Hello everyone, it's me, and I know it's been a while. Um, happy Merry Christmas, Happy New Year's, the Happy Thanksgiving, like everything I think I missed. Um, I am going to do a quick face today. Um, <clears throat> you could see um, the this, this same problems are still here. My face is very red. I'm super tired. Um, there's a lot going on in my life, but I'm going to... Um, Start my face. So I'm using Dr. Brandt. I know people do this. I don't know why they do that, but oh, 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 oh. but it's um, triple antioxidant eye cream. I need it. I should just like seriously um, put it all over my face and inject it in my eyes. But anyway, I use my uh, middle finger because you want to be real delicate around your eyes, um, and you just you know your index finger tends to be a little bit harder. So, I don't know why I'm out of breath. I think, I'm, when I'm on these things, I don't talk. I'm, I don't talk. How I talk, I don't breathe. Okay, so I'm using my phone as a mirror. I'm just putting it all around my eye. Just rubbing it in, letting it sit for a little bit. So, I <laughs> did my laundry the other day. My life has been extremely crazy uh, lately. Um, I moved to my art studio, and uh, because my landlord was a prick, he, uh, he, didn't provide heat or hot water, so obviously you can't have an art studio without heat or hot water. So I had to move, and I found a great place. But um, so anyway, I did my laundry the like the other day, and like I do every day, um, because I have to. And my um, dryer sheet was in my pants, and I had um, leggings on, and uh, <laughs> I don't know how I didn't realize it. I'm using this primer. Um, I don't know how I didn't realize it, but um, it was the kind of bunched up on my butt cheek. Not that everybody looks up my ass, but um, that one person probably was looking at my ass and I had, they were probably like, uh, what is that? So it looked like I had something bunched up by my butt. <laughs> but anyway, um, that brings... That was not my butt. That was this. So, primer. I put way too much on my hand just now. Or my finger. So, that brings me to um, the probability of that person probably being my soulmate. I'm having... Uh, I came to the conclusion. Some of you know my, um, my track record. I was married. Um, I've dated a few... A few people who weren't for me to be nice. Um, and I guess it looks at my age that I could, I must be crazy because how can I not secure a relationship um, at this age? And I don't think, I never bring my past relationships over into my new ones. And I know a lot of us have a tendency of doing that. And and I I bet I did this backwards. Um, but I don't. But I think what happens, um, I think what happens is that we tend to um, accept things a little bit more than we should. So, because you... The one thing I do carry is that I want my next relationship to be successful. So I tend to um, disregard red flags or pink flags or things that normally, like, that would bother me. I try to have them not bother me. And then eventually it just adds up and um, I, I leave. So um, I am not one. To, that that lacks communication. I try to talk about what bothers me. Well, actually, I do talk. But when they're not... My cats are fighting. Stop it. Um, but when, when they're not receptive, it just... Look, you can tell when I put my foundation, foundation on. Just how red my face is. Um, so I'm using the brush to apply it. So I don't think... I'm not saying I'm perfect by far. I am needy. I'm a cuddler. 
Um, I like my own space sometimes, which I think everyone should really have that. But I want a partner. Like I want someone who is there, you know, that, that is present in the moment. And um, I feel that there should be a level of priority in every relationship on both sides. And it's, it's lacking. So um, I don't know how I got into this conversation from a dryer sheet in my pants, but I'm there. So I don't know if I, I mean, I, I really don't think I'm crazy. I don't think I'm super needy. I'm pretty self-sufficient um, or self-sustaining. I, um, I just, I don't know. Maybe I just have, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not picky, but I want to be wanted or thought of. Like I want someone present. Is that really that hard nowadays? Like, is it that, like, is it that hard? So I'm using bronzer. And go above your hollow. I'm so chubby now that I don't probably can't even make a hollow. There we go. I make a line. So, and then I bring it up to my hairline. So I don't know. I don't know if that's really my issue anymore. Like my tolerance level for um, for a partner or a boyfriend or whatever not being present has gone down. Um, I, I don't want to be alone. I don't want to be uh, alone while in or lonely in a relationship. I'm pretty fine being alone at this point. Like... I don't even know if the effort is um, even worth it because it's like mentally draining. Um, if my current relationship takes a big shit, um, I don't think I'm going to go back out for a while. My son um, is my main focus anyway. So, but I don't know. I don't know. I'm probably saying too much. I'm probably going to catch so much shit for this. He's like, we got a camera. Just seriously. Just. I can't. So. We'll see how that goes. I'm not using any setting powder. I, like I said, I'm kind of doing a quick face right now. Whoa. That was not the color. I went here. And I wanted to go there. So that's not the color I was hoping for. Well, we'll just make it work. So, here I go. If I, well, hey, if I go out looking like a prostitute today with all this makeup on, maybe I'll find someone. <laughs> I have to shut up. I didn't bring any other brush but this one with me. So, I'm just going to really blend that in. creating a jawline that I no longer have because I have 1,206 chins. So that, and I'm going to put a little bit of pink on my, my apples. I have the um, highlighters here. I'm going to grab, oh, wait, this one called Confident, and I'm going to grab that one today, or Empowered. No, oh, okay. I need a little confidence today. I'm just using my finger and I'm going down the bridge of my nose. And then on the tip, do a little highlight there. Lips. Like right on the lip bow there. And my brow line. I have to fill in my brows because uh, I over plucked. Oh, wait, hold on a second. I have my big booty. Big booty. My shadows. I'm going to use that. Put it here. This is like super fast today. Super fake. She's super freak. Oh, I can't do that, can I? Because I can get like copyrighted or something. I have to control my 
uh, desire to sing to you because I'm not loud. Not that anyone is going to see this probably. But now I'm going for the darker brown and I'm using more of a, more of a harder blending brush. And I'm going with the flick upward from that little line that I make above my crease because I'm older so my eyes, my, my like, I have heavy lids now. I never did. But uh, I'll do now because I'm getting old. So here, I'm just blending them in. I'm taking my blender brush and I'm just going to really soften that line a little bit. I'm going to go back to my um, my highlighters here, one of the lighter highlighters, and just blend some of that highlighter over there. Okay, here's my, I hope this one isn't dead. Make my cat eye, ooh, I don't like this one. Um, I don't know if you can see that, I can't even say it right, it's Ara. Aricelli. Um, it's very wet and I think it smears so you have to be real careful. I start in like in the middle of my lash line there. I angle it up and flick out and I'm just going to fill that in. I have a scar on my eyelid so it um, I always feel like it skips a beat there. So that's that's one eye. Oh, actually, this one is a, no. It's wet. It's very wet. Um, sorry, I'm covering it there. Flick it out, and then I'm going to fill in that little. Oh yeah. This is the one I grabbed. It is. A, it is nice, and it's. It does make a nice line, but I just feel that it, like it takes forever to dry and I, I lack patience. So I'm going to fill in my eyebrows, dry my hair, and I'll be back. I'll be, I'll be back. 